Hello everybody, welcome to the round of 16 match of CCL Season 49. We've got Martin Septum in his Amazons versus Tempest Soul and his Dark Elves. In the booth with me is Kalon and Skurametso. Hello! Hello! Oh, that's scary. What a yeah. what a bad kick. And yeah, uh, scatter really results here in, <laughs> yeah, the rain. And the, in the rain as well. I mean, does have edge for sure hands, so it does have a pretty legit way of being yeah. able to pick it up, but um, and is going to be able to make it somewhat secure. But um, yeah, it's a cool Amazon team. Martin Septon did a well. There we go. <laughs> That's a really nice start. Um, really nice. Martin Septon's got a, a, a really nice Amazon team. Has a couple of red numbers, as you can see. Uh, stats flowing overhead. Uh, so that's that's always nice to see on a, an otherwise boring team. Um, and Tempest Souls team is fine. Could this be yes. the best chance Amazons have ever had at winning CCL? Oh, he Jimmy. snakes the pickup. It could be. Oh, maybe not oh. anymore. I think he got away. With, he's got away with it, hasn't he? Oh, Guard really rocketed has. by guards. That was yeah, a good scout. Yeah, he really got away with that. That's. Oh, fireball! Instant Ooh. fireball! Wow! 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 Oh wow! Let's see how well this goes. Oh, maybe he it. hasn't got away with it. No, he hasn't. My, my follow-up, my follow-up question was going to be: Isn't Tempest Soul known to be a bit of a mad lad? He is a bit of a mad lad. Yeah, he was the overdog, <laughs> and he got him, he got himself a wizard, right? Because got Martin Septim has a wizard yeah. and a babe. So there was a 50 TV advantage for Tempest Soul, and he gave them both a wizard, which makes sense because he's got a match five blitzer yeah. and yeah. obviously dark elves, yeah. eleven man dark elves. So, yeah, you know, why not? Yeah, oh, this is going to be a game and a half, guys. <laughs> yeah, what a start. Incredible start. Unbelievable. <laughs> so, yeah, insert, Instant Wizard is always an interesting one. I think he would have been happy if he'd managed to knock down maybe one more guy. Because um, it's going to be tricky to get in here. That Strength 5 Bjor up the front is uh, pretty nice. Mm. Um, strength 5 Blodge, or Dodge. No, uh, no other skills on her. Uh, hasn't been as aggressive as you'd expect with him either, but uh, with her, I should say. Um, but overall, I think he's uh, he's been playing really nice. But both, um, it's great to see Martin doing well. And uh, and as uh, Skoro says, uh, Tempest Soul, uh, absolute fucking mad lad. Uh, <laughs> yeah. See how things go here. Yeah. So we're gonna. Is he, I don't know how he's gonna crack this. To be fair. To be fair. To be fair. Oh wow, he's not. He's gonna do skull. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, no tackle here. Gets the wrestle mm. down, so at least got her out of the way so that she can make the run around the corner. But I don't think that was what he planned. No, he's, what can he's, he's, he's what just can even do here. He gets kind of diving tackle, sidestep on the ball, I guess. Yeah. Mm. He just gets. Does he try to scatter it on a one D? Yeah. Yeah, I guess that's all he can do. He, he needs to get, how does he get this guy through? That's the question. There's a lot position. of good scatter squares for him, to be fair. To be fair. To be fair. <laughs> but yeah, that wasn't one of them. And how does he get through? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's way worse. Yeah, it's really, really worse. He can't get through there either. And he can get the DT around the back, but... Oh, pops a dodge. Oh, wow, pops it again. Oh, yeah, so it's just a mark. Ooh. This uh, this this worked out quite nicely for Martin Septum, I think, all things considered. Yeah. The, um, yeah. Wizard gone. Wizard, wizard gone. Ball uh, not stolen. Elves are nice enough to base up so that he can hit them back. Yes. It's all going to come down to how well these hits go, isn't it? Basically. Yeah. 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 Could yeah. have some bad luck here, and again, a failed pickup again would be a problem. It would. Yes. Yeah, the DT on the ball there is pretty tricky. But you can just stand up with the girl at the back and stand up to the left and uh, make that push out pretty easy. It's also going to be a three dice as well if he gets in there. I think he just probably blitz with the third player. Yeah, that's not terrible. Because then that, but, that definitely frees up yep. the edge forward, isn't it, to pick it up. be really nice so, to get the hit off on him and it can make it 3d as well but yes you're right it's much better to just do it like that still gonna require a bit of uh one and nining to protect the ball if he does get it in hand yeah because yeah. Yeah, that wrestle is you know jump up and everything so she's still available next turn to go and do whatever she wants yep and the tackle witcher in the corner as well yeah i mean you've got to punch this one right mighty blow on string mm -hmm. four and you've got to dodge this at the end of the turn. And I guess you yeah. could blitz with the Ash 4 itself, and then that leaves you this one stood there, I guess. Mm -hmm. But either way... God, that, 
Oh, oh he's not blitzing. He's not blitzing this one at all. Hmm. That strength five wants another skill so fucking badly. Yeah. <laughs> so, I mean, maybe that's the plan. Maybe he's just going to three dice. Well, he's got and, a dodge uh, to do that, which, which is he's not going to three dice. Is he? Okay. Because he'd have to do a one in nine first, which would be too yeah too risque. Yeah, I, I actually missed the guy standing over the top for a time. Uh, yes, yeah, well, yeah, if he, if he wasn't stood there, he would have 3D'd him, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then I guess so, how's your free now? There. Yeah. Gets the pick up. Go back in. I don't know, I mean, he hasn't got a key. Yeah, they're probably not moving the strength five. Hmm. Oh. Oh, no, okay. he's got tackle there. You could dodge with him. Like he gets here, doesn't he? He can dodge there and just get there. Yeah. yeah. Whereas this one would have to like dodge and run all the way around yeah, and then around. hit him. Yeah, and double then... dodge, I think. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So he has yeah, to take dodge. this three plus off. Uh... Double dodge a GFI. Yeah. Or you just go three plus off tackle. Interesting decision to make. Just the three plus off tackle. Here we go. Yeah, recovered. Recovered yep. into quite a good spot, really. Just to be a nice wizard here. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair. Yeah, Jimmy has proclaimed that Amazon's will never win Chalice, but nevertheless, it's a nice team and Martin's pretty good at Blubble. Hmm. By the way, Dimmy is better than Dimmy G. <laughs> oh, no way, did he? Oh, ouch. Oh, he's not going to like that. <laughs> he's probably not going to like that, no. No. Because you know how there's that Dimmy who's got a, 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 a Blood Bowl 2 account? Yeah. Um, yeah. There was somebody at this tournament who was just called Dimmy. Just so it's, called Dimmy, yeah. So that's probably an actual real account. We just thought it was a trolling account. Um, you know, to, to mess up the EAB because there's a Jimmy and there's a Dimmy. <laughs> so, but it turns out Dimmy is actually a real person. Probably. Thank you, Steve. Yep, that's the man. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, all three day two, including to Dizzy. Yeah. And Dizzy's pretty good. But um, it would appear that um, despite the champ being the champ, uh, Undead are not OP. Yeah. Glorious. Yeah, no, there you go. I won't Look, we've got. In until I'm victorious. <laughs> and Wait, I why is it calm? I will defend. There we go. We've got Dimmy. Dimmy in 50th and Dimmy G in 58th. So there you wow. go. <laughs> Dimmy, Dimmy G, not even the best Dimmy. <laughs> Yikes. No, is it. He's going to have to call himself Gimme, Gimme D now. Whoa, oh, Gimme D! Gimme D, baby! Oh, yeah! Oh, I hope that one sticks. <laughs> oh, my God. And, and, and amongst uh, that, Tony thanks. plays poorly. Yeah, Tony, Tony. Yeah. Unbelievable. What a, what a time to re-sub, Tony. <laughs> 65 glorious months. Unbelievable. Thank you so much. Incredible. Sick, Tony. PC, you playing today? Oh my god. Doesn't he have a game coming up? Uh, uh, he's played his uh, second round match, hasn't he? Oh, oh, he did. Oh, he did. Yeah. I've got no idea. <laughs> he's got to. He's got to play his uh, third round game between him and uh, Doug to the Dog, or otherwise known as Kill. Ah, Bill. yes. Yeah, there you go. So he hasn't played it yet, then. No. Oh yeah, that is this round. Because yeah. Speaking of. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm Hello. Just... Hey! So I'm not. I'm yeah. not staying for long. We have family cool. dinner imminently. Otherwise, I would have loved to have popped on and chatted. Um, yes, I, I'm playing tomorrow. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Kill Bill waltzes humans. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. Glorious. Um, he's American, so it's quite late. Mm. It's American. Oh. Um, uh, what time then? <laughs> Poor bastard. I know. <laughs> Uh, super exciting game, um, PC. I'm really looking forward to 21 seeing 21 UTC, so 10 o'clock UTC. Okay, 10 o'clock UTC, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Glorious. <laughs> yeah. Um, which would be fun, won't it? Huge, nasty humans against little, tiny, poor little dwarfs. Oh, Indeed, yes. yeah. <laughs> and coached by an elf as well, that makes it even harder I know. for the dwarfs. I, know. <laughs> I, I, I don't have the freedom of the whole field on a 2+. plus. 
Mm. I've, I've gimped myself with these, these poor little stunty things. <laughs> yeah, these, the limitations no are you know, palpable. Mm. I still hope to bring some of that elf magic to it. We'll see. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, what a definitely. weekend they've been having up in Derby. Yeah, it looks like it's been really, really fun. And once uh, it wasn't the wife swapping. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so it, yeah, it looks like everybody had a really good weekend, um, and fair play to Dizzy Bees for having uh, streamed most of it. N nearly um, everyone, to be fair. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, unless your name is Calcium. To be yeah. fair. Yeah. Yeah. To be fair. The one or person we've talked to went there and fucking yeah. hated it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I, I think he's a strong favourite, Willie. I mean, humans, particularly on Blood Bowl 2. They're not strong against some races, they are against others, like lots of things. Um, I thought I did reasonably well to get past Bretonians, who are terrible, but not but reasonably effective against dwarves. Yeah. Um, humans, they've got, you know, the catchers are AV8, which is really handy against dwarves, um, but they're also fast enough to outpace the dwarves, um, and they've got enough block guard light, um, blitzers to, you know, to hold steady on the line. Um, but obviously they shouldn't get toe-to-toe -to -toe in a long fight. If he does, that should go okay for me. He's got no Ogre. Um, no, he does not. I have yeah. no Troll Slayer, so... Mm -hmm. You know, the traditional battle between Troll Slayer and Ogre will not be joined. Yeah. There's quite a chunk of uh, change for you, uh, nevertheless, though. Um, you do have some money in the kitty, I, 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 is what I, I mean. I think I do, yes. Yeah. I'd have rather seen another foul here. He could have had another foul, right? And, uh, this cage another assist. Another, 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 yeah, another assist. That's another yeah, foul. Yeah. He could have had another yeah. assist, yeah. This, these could have yeah. all been one square up. They could. I was thinking the same thing. Yeah, it could have been uh, could have been a bit tidier and had more stuff. But it, you know, didn't get caught. Um, gets the apple used as well, which is pretty rowdy from Tempest Soul, uh, as we'd expect. Yeah, I mean, in my head, I had Tempest Soul as the huge favourite for this one, but um, I don't know. Maybe not. Martin Septon's playing very well lately, isn't he? Isn't he? Yes, mm. exactly that. And uh, and it is a decent Amazon team as well. It really so. is. Yeah. yeah. I don't believe that Amazons can never win Chalice. They need the right draw, but so does any race. Yeah, for sure. I mean, well, look at Doug, it's, Doug, it's, Doug. the quote is Amazons will never win Chalice. Not that they cannot win Chalice. Okay, they but never they never will. will. Right. Okay. okay. Well, then that's that's more a sort of Nostradamusy prediction than a mm -hmm. sort of you know, intelligence situation. I don't know. Quiz, 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 pitch quiz champion. Pitch champion. Yes, you mean. You know? Quiz, quiz, quiz champion. Champion. Yes, yeah, he made his made his, uh, his, but, his proclamation. You know, as the second best Dimmy, I I do wonder if. <laughs> I mean, and that's to our knowledge. There may be many other Dimmys. Yeah, indeed. Yeah. Oh, man. He's not going to be happy with this at all. <laughs> <laughs> He's a second-rate Dimmy. Does that mean he has to grow the mustache, the the goatee, and be evil Dimmy? Oh, maybe. Yeah. 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 Perhaps we do. Perhaps we have Dimmy from the wrong timeline. Yeah, yeah. The other Demi, no one has heard from the other Demi. Somewhat like the imposter Steve Motti, it's it's not a figure that we've spoken to. We're just aware of them. <laughs> oh man, imagine if Dimmy joins an Among Us one time. We've got Dimmy G and Dimmy. That would be wonderful. <laughs> oh god. The um, I do actually have a. I, I mean, I obviously I'm mostly playing elves, but I just dabbled a tiny bit in some dwarves this season. You know, just to find out how the other half live. That's <laughs> yeah, just to see what it was about. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they're sort of doing all right. Mm. And there's a Steve Motti and a Jimmy Fantastic, uh, long beard blockers, uh, who are both straight yeah. forward. Nice. Yes, indeed. Yeah. And a Dim uh, you've got a Dimmy G who's uh, very close to a level as well. Uh, he might be dead. Some have died. Oh, that's fair. Yeah. This does happen. It does. Yeah. Mm. I'm not very careful with my toys. <laughs> well. Either they, you know, win the game for you, or they die, and yeah. both of those are acceptable results. Whoa, Absolutely. triple skull! Ooh. Ooh. Gosh, Two rerolls left. It's the strength four. I mean, it's, it's the first it. half, they're disposable rerolls. Yeah. You can throw one at them. Oh, he's already used oh. one, and it's only turned four. I think that was probably the right call. Tough call, but I think well, it's it was this, probably correct. This modern fashion for you know, three rerolls in an uh, overtime format, I'm not a yeah. huge fan. Mm. Well, you are running four with your dwarves, but admittedly, well, you're, not, you're not hugely experienced with the dwarves, so maybe you think that that's a better <laughs> run with them, being an elf coach, I mean. Yeah, I mean, if you reach overtime, I think you've probably still got one left, haven't you? 
Yes. Um, I mean, I have got four at the moment. That may not last till the game. I can Indeed. coach with three because there's a lot Indeed. of skills on the dwarves. But an overtime format, you know, four or even five is not huge amounts of rewards. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, no, it's a tantalizing game, though. Yeah. Um, absolutely massive, and include the ball in it. Do everything you can, and just you yeah. know, kick it as hard as you can. You might even be able to auto break. In fact, yeah, I think it, yeah, it's. Yeah, Especially because field, it, it was massive, yeah. It's You've got enough guard to ensure that even if for any the last weird round, reason so. you staked it somehow, the, the, yeah. the ball's fine. Um, you're not getting hugely out of position for it either, and you can just drag, drag everybody into it. So yeah, this is literally where you want to be, so it's fine. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Seems to disagree. I'm getting up a wing instead. Well, there is space. But it's such a juicy target. It's such a game-changing target. Oh, yeah, I'm fouling that 100%. 100%. Yeah, if, I mean, if I was dead, it would be a million percent. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> exactly that. Yeah. Yeah, no, I definitely would have fouled it. There's oh, not the costing with... anything. Just, just no. you know, it's, it, you're protecting the ball better by... Uh, you know, like, congregating. Like, yeah, I mean, like a man trying to keep two wives happy, Jim. It's likely you're breeding disappointment. Uh, and it's similarly here, I think we might be trying to both deal with that piece and have a safe cage pushing up the wing. We can't, can we? No, oh, well, I mean, you can if you're lucky. You can if you're lucky. You've just got to believe in the school of Rick Reckless and uh, we're all good and it's all right, you know? Rick and Chunt are both very positive like play it very positively, don't they? You know, yep. like they'll they'll yep. do something that like like this blitz where if it goes wrong, you've you've got a based cage. Well, certainly, if that reroll went wrong, mm. that was horrific. Yeah, 100%, yeah. Yeah. But, I mean, you've got juggernaut, so all you really needed was a push. But well, he could have he could have taken the push anyway. The problem was that he was hitting sidestep and realised that he couldn't take the one in nine push. He yes, I mean, ultimately, you'd have, you know, if it was just oh, a, wow. <laughs> a skull well, and a both down, you'd you'd take the both down but, and probably. Push what do we know? You just need yeah. one assist. The to... There you are. See, it turns out you yeah. can have. I'm yeah, going to call Andy my girlfriend yeah. and tell her that no, I'm not leaving my wife. <laughs> I shall stick with both. <laughs> <laughs> just wrong. That's the message there. That solved my dilemma. <laughs> You've got to be lucky, though. You've got to be lucky, PC. See, Rick could get away lucky, with it. Jim. Rick could get away with it. Chunter could get away with it. <laughs> Me, not Maybe so Maybe I wouldn't. Is that what you're saying? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it's kind of... A, it, it's not... The t uh, like, after having one assist and dirty player, I would not have rolled the foul. I wouldn't have even gone for it. Well, it was... It was a oh, you, you've got to... You could also yeah. put a couple of assists in still like done that foul earlier well, in the round. Yeah, exactly. And if I, it hadn't... Not called, you could have still taken the space, but it, he he did both and got away with it massively, yeah. which is, is huge. It's great. Yeah. yeah. Ballsy play, though. Right, I've got a lovely dinner. I hope this will still be going on. Obviously, over time when I finish. Glorious. See you lovely later, having you. Yourself, gentlemen. Thank you for letting me pop in. Thank you. That was purple chest, ladies and gentlemen. What a delight. Yes. And, uh, <laughs> it was a great foul, that wasn't it? I would have made that foul. <laughs> but, <laughs> I mean, yeah, super lucky. One assist, dirty play, got the break. Like that was that was so greedy to to try and take the space. And like the space isn't even that good space, right? Because it's it's close to the sideline against two witch elves. So yeah. I don't even like taking the space that much. Whereas you just said more central to uh to get the foul inside. I've definitely just made a mega gang foul and probably just rolled a double one and got sent off. Right, that's yeah. the difference. That's the difference. Whereas he gets the space and gets the cars. Perfect. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, well played. Uh, these are skill plays that uh people in like Martin Septon are able to make and get him really far in chalice. And the reason that I'm bad at blood ball. Hmm. Uh, really that's unfortunate there from Tempest Stole to um get the um just pushes with four dice on the stand firm yeah needed her out of the way so that he could get some uh, stuff through on the weaker diagonal but i mean now he's almost up shit creek right he's down two players yeah. and his wizard and the best and the best one so yeah the best one is gone yeah and somehow he was the higher tv in this match because yeah. martin septon has got a bib as well so yeah this is yeah this is looking really good for martin now really nice famously quite cheap Mm. Price is averted. I spilled my paint water on huh? my desk. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I've been cleaning it for the last five minutes, apologizing for just disappearing there. But you're quite all right. We were we were blessed by the company of uh, Mr. Purple Chest. I know. So did he? Done. Is he? Oh, is he gone now? He is. He has, he's yeah. gone. Gone to get a bite to eat. But it worked out perfectly. It did. 
We're, some would say we're the same person. Mm. No one, no one would say that. No, no. But, um, but it's nice to think that they might. We're both oh, wow. equally good at Blood Bowl. That's all that really matters. <laughs> That's not up for dispute, yeah. The Jaguars have got an interception and a touchdown, so I've, I've just got 13 oh, points nice. on my defense. Nice, Glorious. very nice. Jags defense, yeah. Cool. Mm. Doesn't, doesn't put oh, why did I even look at my stupid team? Good lord. <laughs> I've, got, I've got five total points so far for the week. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> and that's with one team having played on Thursday night. One player, which is the Miami defense. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this, is, this isn't going to go well for me. <laughs> um, so yeah, well, PC said something there, didn't he? Uh, when he was... I mean, he said a lot of things, but he said one thing. In particular. Um, oh yeah, about the being. No, it wasn't. It was Walid saying that the. Uh, no, P P PC said that he thought Dog to the Dog, Dog to the Dog is not the favourite in that matchup. Um, uh, no. No, I think Dog to the Dog. You know, his team for a human team, it's better. Like, do you know what I mean? If you were going to rate a human team out of ten and a, the dwarf team out of ten, the human team is a better human team and the dwarf is a dwarf team. However, the dwarf team is still a dwarf team, so. <laughs> <laughs> so I still think your dwarves are that much better than humans. That it's he's still it's still better. Yeah. Well, gets around the uh, what was that four in the first round, and then yeah, I'm just I'm joking. Because you have to count these things because that's how you play football. Mm. But uh, the, doesn't get him on the three. Gets him on the two. Nice use of uh, not stand farming there to turn it into uh, five dice instead of six. But does get him on the fifth. Yeah. Correct. Um. Yeah, I think it's a. I, I think that's a mouth wandering game, though. Um, both really solid coaches um, uh, playing their preferred teams as well. Um, sorry, I can say it because he's not here. Um, but yeah, PC is pretty good at the old dwarfs. Um, so yeah, I, I think that's going to be a really great game. And the winner goes on to play Eliad. Oh, glorious! Yeah, the lone wamp. So Eliad will will actually be favoured more against the dwarves and the humans, I think. So it, yeah. Yeah. Elia definitely wants PC to win because he'd much rather play the, the dwarfs than the humans. Yeah. Because the humans would almost definitely make shit of him. Well, he's got a strength for Tackle Palmer, hasn't he? Tackle which, Palmer. Is, which is perfect exactly. to go and hunt vamps. It's insanely good. Whereas, you know, PC has got lots of Tackle Mighty Blow, but they're all strength yeah. three and slow as balls. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. you, want your, uh, you want your human Van Helsing. Yeah. It's the speed of it as well is the big big deal because humans are great because they're so fast. Yeah. Yeah, that that's the thing, Paraville. They are doing great considering the shit. But the thing is, it's just that one player that one player is so good, isn't it? And then the Cheney is so good that like it actually works out maybe it's even better in having a crap team to go with it than a good team. Debating the Apo on that, because it is a guard, mm. but uh decides not to. Um interesting. Was a badly hurt, Probably was guaranteed hurt. having it back, but uh, I suppose with the various different hits that were coming in, it was a wrestle hit, though, down, down the goes that girl. Well, I think I'd do the same, because I would be very unbelievably confident of winning this game now if I was not accepting, so I would just be greeting my yeah. apple for, like, a, a yeah. miss next. Uh, or one a, of the good ones. Yeah, yep. yeah. Well, just a miss I, next. I, yep. Like even even this even this player I would let be badly hurt probably. <laughs> I mean maybe not. Maybe I'd maybe mm. I'd up all this one and a badly hurt. Um, yeah. But and that, the ball carrier. Well, I don't know. Yeah, maybe it's probably too late if the ball carrier's got cast. <laughs> like if the ball carrier gets cast this this drive, you probably you probably shit out of luck. But um, yeah, it's like he should he should definitely win. I mean he's got a bit of bit of distance to go, hasn't he? Like, there's, there's, there's some elves in the way still. Mm -hmm. so it's not 100%. So Especially if he's on this guy. Oh, gets mm -hmm. the full power on him as well. I wonder if he'll pile this on. He's done. Bad bet on him not piling it on. Oh, yeah, no, that's a good point. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like he's not going to pile it on because he doesn't have piling on. <laughs> Does indeed have Juggernaut instead of piling on. Which is fair. Yep. Not what I'd do, but, you know, who can say if it's good or bad? I don't think it's... I think it's fine. I think it's fine. I think it's wrong. It would, it depend on, it would depend on what the rest of the uh, the, the team had at the time. Cause Not maybe to me. Have a, maybe it would have a partner. But yeah, no, I understand. <laughs> Not to me. <laughs> but yes, people, uh, people can think different things, and he's made Chalice. Yeah, 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 so yeah, there yeah, you go. Yeah. He's, he's headed to the quarterfinals. 
but um, you know, I just think it's wrong. Mm-hmm. More so on yeah. zones, right? Because you don't have a one turn. Like if it was uh, yep. if it was on say high elves or whatever, then mm, juggernaut for the sense, yeah, yeah juggernaut helps you with the one turn, helps you with the dacker and stuff, but um, helps you not putting a you know 150 TV player on the ground, whatever. More than that, um, 200 yep. TV player on the ground. So like there's 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 a whole load of reasons to take jugs over the, on, Oh my god, just doing that dodge with an open cage is yeah, a bit crazy. mental. Yeah. Jesus. Does he know that this isn't a cage? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. No, well, that was a good foul, oh, though. <laughs> wow. Well, take that, Wrestle Witch. <laughs> and that's worth the scent off. Oh, it's Elliot as well. No, <laughs> Paravel. So, I mean, it's still um, not a cage. It's still not a cage. And uh, <laughs> Paravel thinks it looks like a cage, so it's definitely not a cage. Yeah, that was a good um, one. <laughs> <laughs> nice one. Nice. Um, yeah, nice foul. Um, absolutely terrible uh, decision to make the foul there because he was an open cage and etc etc. Mm. Um, yeah. It's not that good, right? Because it's it's got to be a one D, and you need the pal to get the one D on him. So, but I mean, you might as well do the one D on him. See if you get the pal. It's not yep. even it's not even t block even. So yeah, you can bring in an assist and one D. Yeah, just bring in the assist and one D, and then yeah, see what happens. Fifty fifty, you get a one D on the ball. He is running out of good players. He is, yeah. In the fact that he had three, and two of them are... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. And also he's capped at eight for the rest of the match. So it's, he is capped at eight as well. It's pretty terrible for him. Yeah, this is... Uh... Yeah. Well, you know, he's learning. Hmm. It's his team name, you see. Yes. Correct. <laughs> It's not even that hard with. to dodge an assist over uh, no. if you do clear up the space to hit the ball there. This yeah, guy went to it, who uh, was under the impression that a, a pun was when was specifically when somebody in a movie said the name of the movie. Wow. I don't know what gave him that idea, but that's what he thought a pun was. Which is... Oh, he's just going in. He's just going in. Wow. Ooh. <laughs> and doesn't get him. Oh my God, get someone in here. You want on the blitz. <laughs> Wow. Why didn't he bring in the Wrestle Witch? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Banto! Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yeah. I mean, yeah, this is a, this is a good defense for just not getting scored on. But, yep. You know, unfortunately, it's still quite easy to score against defenses like this because you can just roll some dice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> is the problem. Or you can do all these kind of things, but I don't know, like just leaving your opponent the ability to just roll some dice and get past it just seems to end badly. Mm -hmm. more Defending often the ball is super. I find. Easy. Could be debating the wizard here. It'd be nice to just waste that agility or the strength four. Hmm. I don't think he needs to though. Like no, I'm neither do I. I'm just, <laughs> I, I think it's I think it's an interest. It's not worth yeah. like you've got three minutes, so there's no reason not to take. Yeah, him yeah, yeah. Just like they the the gift of the first two turns, getting rid of mm -hmm. that that wizard and having one, and probably being very likely to score anyway. Mm -hmm. it seems like just keeping that wizard for the second half all but ends the game. It's interesting. Yeah. Super interesting. So where does he decide to go? Probably your matters, does it? Um, it might do. I mean, it's getting cast. Oh yeah, for <laughs> him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that. The old uh, take side steps so you can decide which square you get removed from. Yeah. Oh, no, only a stone. Hmm. I think I would have sidestepped to here just to like maybe fuck yeah, with the breakthrough a little bit. Yeah, exactly that, yeah. So some dodges and uh, one of them is a four plus off tackle and the other one is a six plus off diving tackle. Oh. I don't I think dodge this one. Yeah, yeah. Into there. Yeah. 
there, yep. <clears throat> and then dodge this one over here, over mm -hmm. here, or blitz with that. Yeah. This this, this in here is good though, right? Because it's guard. It is, yeah, because it's, it's, it gives them both hits. Yeah, it gives them but yeah, it gives both hits. But then you might just dodge this one as well. I don't, this is pretty tricky because you obviously you want to bl block there and then and then blitz this one, but you can't block there, so... They're probably all shouldn't have followed. It probably shouldn't have followed here. I don't know where he was. No, he did. He didn't. Um, he didn't. It was that was the that was the direct hit. So maybe he should have followed. Yeah. To free up this this one. You're gonna follow this to get. Uh, oh, no, oh, that was the blitz. Oh wow. That was okay. the blitz. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> That's super interesting. Isn't it? Super interesting. Dauntless, Dauntless skill. Mm. Yep. That was interesting. That he could have used the Dauntless then to deal with him. Yeah. And then blitz this one. That might have been the play to to have relied yep. on Dauntless. Oh yeah, I didn't I didn't even see the Dauntless, so yeah. So just dodge with that one and go in, and then you rely on Dauntless to get the 2D, and then you could have blitzed there and one in nine was due. Yep. Fucking fatten again, man. <laughs> well, he's old. <laughs> is this one sidestep is the, or stand firm? It's stand firm. That's yeah, huge stand firm there. Otherwise, you could just pushed him in and got the guard. Yeah, and then, yeah. I mean, it's still pretty bad, though. That's still a pretty bad one uh, to fail. Can't he do it from the witch? Yeah, but you want to hit with the witch, don't you? Because it's got frenzy and tackle. So... Yeah, but you can shove the string four in with the witch. Yeah, but you, but you would you want to put the witch because it's. Oh, you're all right, 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 right. Because right. well, you want to so. put guard in and then send the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that's what I'd want to do. I see. I guess, especially as you could have pushed it and then surfed it, right? Mm. If if this didn't have stand firm, if this didn't have stand firm, you get a two D into a two D into a surf, like it would have been incredible. You could still hit with this somehow. Maybe maybe you've got to use the witch. Problem with the witches, it's into an up. Oh, it's into a one D, isn't it? Yeah. Because uh, he's got guard. No, it's into an up. He's got two guard. Yeah, so it's a, it's a it's a. Oh, okay. Yeah. I guess not if you take him out first, which he doesn't. So yeah, you make that hit first. Uh, maybe not because mm -hmm. it'd been good to have this blitz at the end as well. Yep, yeah, recovery or whatever. The two and the yep. uphill is the old uh, frenzy opportunity. Mm. Oh, you could. You, what you could do is you could just blitz with this guy right now. Oh no, because you don't have guard. Yeah. Ugh. Yeah. Oh. Skulls. Oh, and into oh. the uphill. <laughs> oh, lords. Wow. Well, you still shove him in, and then. Oh, gets away with it. Get away with it. You can be mine. Glorious. Thank you very much, Max Schreiber, for the raid. Hello. Hello and hello, Max viewers. Hey, might Max. have been uh, might have been a little premature in uh, estimating that uh, Martin was going to have an easy time scoring here. He's not yeah. even in range with the ball. Yeah, no, he's not. And he's about to he's, get. Yeah, he might even. Yeah. Uh, it's one dice currently. Uh, two, if you just you just two from here, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Another. He's had six dice on the ball, and they've all been both downs. <laughs> all been both downs. Yeah. That was actually a little bit of a risky blitz because if he got pushes, then he does put the ball in range. Yeah, true, yeah. true, true. I think Very I would have just won, dude. Might might have done better. Might have done better not uh, not well, getting it. Honestly, he might even just be better off with the ball currently where it is. Yeah. Although I guess. It's, yeah, it's bad, yeah. Does he have scoring threat by any chance? Did he bring one of the other guys down? The, well, he's got. Oh, the dark elves. No. Yeah. No, he he didn't. actually can push this into range, and then it's not too many dodges. Yeah, yeah. I'm just trying to work out how best to do it. Just run around the corner yeah, and punch think, that way. Yeah, yeah, I think the dauntless runs behind and. You want to take the dauntless the hit up. on the on the guard though, right? Well, yeah, well, I and you want to hit need, this guy. Uh, yeah. You don't yeah. need to hit him because you could, you could, you when you get forward, but you want to hit this guy somehow. Maybe one D him first. Yeah. Or like hit the witch. No, oh, you can't hit the witch because side. Can't really because side step. Yeah. Oh, I actually can one two three four five 
No. Never mind. Ooh, that stun, that stun garter in the back actually kind of. coming around for this. Yeah, I quite like. Oh my god, it's another one and nine. Wow. Uh, Instant reroll. Mm-hmm. Did he need the um? Yeah, because he need did he he's looking at it because he was curious. I think he was going for the push, wasn't he? Yeah, he, and, yeah. I guess oh, the, the push is better. Push, the push yeah, is yeah. better, but yeah, the power is because now he goes up to the he right here. Oh no, no, no! See, that's the, that's what I was saying because he wants to now take this punch on that guy and push him another square forward. Yeah, wouldn't it be better? Mm. Oh, she's sidestep. Mm. I was gonna say, wouldn't it be better to go up to the right and then block with uh, the tackler? Into mm -hmm. the witch. Yeah, but she sidestep. Yeah. But if he if she sidesteps here, you can punch him. But you've only got a one yeah. on him. Yeah. So that's the problem. And then you haven't got a GFI there. I don't know, but then you guess you'd have the assist here. But you still mm -hmm. only have a one because this is there and not there. So do you GFI and then push the push punch the witch? I'll just knock her out of the way and see what square she fills. Yeah. So you, you uh, had her. Yeah, yeah. It accordingly. Yeah. So she's wise to it. So cast. Take. <laughs> 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 wow! Right. So now you can fill that square with the um, with the guard, with the stand firm guard. Not really, because I mean tackle. Oh, he's still up. Sorry, yeah, he's still mm. up. So you just push him, and then you yeah. and then you and then you push this one. Yeah, and get the power. Push. There you go. You're in dodge. Just power, you're fine. Just power everything. Get a removal trim. Yep, just power oh, everything. Okay. Well, Yeah, so we, we, uh, that's what we were talking about, Al Albo Rahambo, uh, was that he could have taken the push, but uh, the fact that he used his reroll so early in the thing means that he can't. You just take the power at that stage. You have to bail on the plan. Yeah, it's been one day, wouldn't it? It's been one day to get the extra push. Yeah. Which I guess you're doing a oh. 2 plus anyway, so, but it's a 3 yeah. plus to save a 2 plus, which. Yeah. But then it is a bit of payoff getting the extra push, so like positionally it made the other hits easier. But you know, this way he got the cast of the other witch, didn't he? So Yeah, exactly. What a half what a half for Martin Sexton, my god. Like yeah. literally two both both witches, like a permanent death, not that it really matters. No. Edge five gone, like seven yeah. players max the rest of the match. It's pretty much over. It's not over. Yeah. It's not over, but it's you know let's see how many um how many more both downs he can roll? But let's let's talk at half speed so that people watching on YouTube can watch it at double speed. <laughs> oh, that's a great idea! <laughs> All right, let me go get high real quick. Ah, <laughs> <clears throat> oh, dear. Well, I can look at my fantasy football team. I'm now 95% to win. Glorious. Why are you doing this for me? Mm. <laughs> Sorry. I have six points. <laughs> I have six points to my opponent's 52. <laughs> a 39% chance to win. Wow, 52. Are, are, are points universal in, in fantasy football leagues? No. No, oh. my, my, my league has kind of weird scoring. Oh, it's a shame that, that they're not universal because it'd be really cool because then you could like do... You could compare yeah. across yeah. the board, then that'd be sick. I mean, I, usually the scoring is, but what they, yeah, yeah, it's not, it's not. And also, like our rosters are different, right? Like you have two starting quarterbacks, I only have one. Now we only have one. It was when Jack that there was an, a previous league Jack oh. Paul was talking about. Oh, that. okay. I thought he was saying. I thought he was saying that league had two. No, so, I've uh, seen that before. I don't hate. There's it, but... been a riot, lads. Just get your no. Yeah. It's not over. Don't say it's over. Yeah. My, uh, my my fantasy fans weren't rioting. That's for damn sure. <laughs> mm. he so here we go. Roll. No, but the knockdown does mean he can at least die, dodge off the two central guys instead of having to rely on the loner hit on the left. Cer certainly. Hmm. Um, watch out. This guy can get... Okay. Well, block is a good skill. Correct. <laughs> so, not great to just have linemen down there. I mean, the strength four is obviously really nice. Oh, the strength four is a bit, sorry, I beg your pardon. Yeah. Which is oh, it does good. take the, it does yeah, take the punch. Wow, in, I would not have uh, taken that hit. Yeah. Yeah. I would have, uh, 
That would have been my my ball receiver, right? right? Yeah, I yeah. I would, I would have had him in front of the strength four, I think. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, and then you could use getting this ball up is going to be. Oh, I guess wow. he doesn't have to do it this turn, but. Ooh, I don't like this. No, I, I don't like this at all. Yeah. I know it's hard, right? He only had seven people. It was, he just yep. set up to hit the LOS and it's like... Yep. Yeah. Probably it's tapped the, out it's, mentally. <laughs> it's the hope that kills you. No, I don't think he will. Uh, as uh, Dr. The Dog just said, uh, he's pretty... Uh, he, he's got quite a good uh, sense of fortitude and uh, he does play quite well. Um, when he's down. I mean, it is over though. <laughs> there is that. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty easy to check out when it's this over. Like yeah, I've got seven players. You've lost. Yeah, yeah. You both, like which you've lost both tacklers. You've lost. Yeah. You're yeah, playing no, Amazon. No, you've lost like... both your tacklers. <laughs> yeah, it, and he's got a wizard. Great. It's not great. <laughs> I mean, I would like. I wouldn't. I would be checked out. I'd still be doing everything I could to win, but you, you've got to be checked out of the game because it's it's pretty much yeah, over. Right? Yeah, it's like ninety nine percent over. Like I was, uh, I was pretty much mentally checked out of the game against Spider, but like I still played, like I still played great for the rest of the match, right? Like it was pretty sure. early when I was when I was checked out of the game, but I still played great for the rest of the match and still nearly won. Like you know, two plus away from winning still. Mm -hmm. But like, you've just got to be realistic, and you fucked here. <laughs> you were totally fucked. Like. <laughs> You're proper fuck. I don't know. I, 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 I disagree. I think there's uh, I think there's definitely some play available. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Maybe not in this half, but there'll be plenty of opportunities in the next half. And the strength five didn't come back, and he is down two other players, so he's only playing on... He's got ten, is he? Two, four, six, ten, eight, yeah. ten, yeah. Well... You're more optimistic than me. Well, yes. <laughs> I mean, I mean, this isn't a revelation. You are, you are a human being, so yeah. That yeah. <laughs> chances are you're more optimistic chances than are. me. Yes, yes, indeed. The house is only half on fire. <laughs> the game is only G. It's not GG. Uh, it's a great question, HTK. I don't think so. I think it's just too, it's too powerful in a second. Just because uh, this was all so unlikely that I don't think it was worth it. But, um, you know, I oh, sorry. It was HDK. It wasn't Greedy Banger that asked. Was it? No, it was. Yeah. It's difficult keeping up on his um, his different monikers. Sellers. <laughs> Gala. Did you say Lewinsky. Stella? <laughs> you said his different monikers, so I said oh, Sellers. Monikers. So yeah, I said Sellers, Gala, Lewinsky. <laughs> Oh, I just got that. <laughs> Monica as opposed to Monica. Yeah, it took me. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah. Monica. <laughs> Monica. Come on. Using a different Monica. Oh. Come on. Yeah. I was waiting for this. Stella. You, can't, you, you really can't make fun of a Boston accent, Calvin. You guys are like a third of a step removed from us. <laughs> uh, I, 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 think, I think what you mean to say is you guys are a sixth removed from us. Reasonable. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So, you know, as the, know only no, as the only non Irish guy in Boston, <laughs> let, yeah. me, let me yeah. tell you. <laughs> I mean, it's it's a really great way to in, um, in, to make sure that everybody in uh, Ireland really likes you. It's for you to arrive over, be really loud and American, and tell everybody about how your grandpappy was Irish. <laughs> and, that, and that you're basically Irish as well. Oh, he might score here anyway. Yep. We absolutely love when people say that to us. <laughs> There's a chance of the toddy. Just make sure you call it Patty's Day as well. <laughs> oh, diced. So close. Imagine if he'd had a re-roll. Imagine if he hadn't rolled both downs every time he tried to sack the ball. <laughs> well, well, I thought the game was over, though. Why was? Why were you excited for this? I thought the game was over. Just because of the YouTube, you know, and the stream. Oh, right. 150 people here, you know, like, I'm just... Come on, man! Get, cut me some well, the slack. Game was the game was. What, you want people to stop watching? What are you? Doing? The game. The <laughs> game was over before the riot, and the riot okay. brought it slightly back in. But if you're if you're banking on a riot to save a game every game, you're a bad streamer. <laughs> <laughs> you're giving false hope to, to those who do not need it. <laughs> I think it's fine. I, th I just think people give up on games of Blood Bowl far too early in general. I think people give up on loads of stuff just far too early. I think you you know. While there's still, you know, the game to be played, you can play the game. 
I and uh, I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't give up. I'm just saying, objectively, it's it's diabolical, and you've got to realize it's diabolical, right? Like that was a thing. Somebody, you know, yeah. like there was another game. Who was it? Um, Aldrea. Whoever played Aldrea, um, you know, had a good chance. Had a good chance to use the wizard early, and yeah. uh, and he didn't, and he was fucked, and he lost, and like he had lost basically in turn one or two because he didn't use the wizard, and. And like, okay, it took another it took another fourteen turns of playing Blood Bowl, and he might have had chances and stuff, but ultimately he had he had to go in he had to go in early with a whiz to give himself a shot because he was so far behind, and I just didn't think yeah. he realised that. You've got to know, you've got to know the like the odds and stuff, haven't you? And like the board state and how 100%. far I, how I far ahead or behind you, you are. I yeah. Agree with it. loads. That's all. That all makes loads of sense. Everything that you're saying makes loads of sense. The idea of calling the game over doesn't. Because realizing you're in a shit situation, understanding how you can get yourself back into it, and keeping your keeping your cool and working towards that goal of keeping yourself in the game, is surely the objective. Saying, "Well, this is over, and I'll just tap GG to my opponent, and I don't have to bother." And I'll go you around. You should the definitely pace. type GG to your opponent. There's yeah, too much the early GG. <laughs> yeah, I, just, I, you know, I just don't think, I don't think, I don't think that helps that much. I think you guys will probably stay in the game longer, and you're like, well, I'll still try to win, and I'll still do all of the right things. That's all fine from you guys saying that because I know that you guys have a lot of experience in playing it. But there's other people who don't have that much experience, and they look at a situation like this and go, well, Jim would say it's over, so why do I, why am I bothering to play this game anymore? Yeah, but and the flip side, but the flip side is being able, being a good coach, and being able to recognize when like. Okay, barring the, barring the unforeseen ridiculousness, this is over. Which means, mm -hmm. which when you say that, it can just mean, oh, I guess I'm giving up on this game. But it could also mean, okay, I'm gonna have to do some pretty gnarly stuff to get there back. You this game. Yeah, you know, there like, you go. Yeah. You know, like, 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 but that's you know, that's what Jim would say. Like, if yeah. Jim is playing a game and he's like, well, this is over, he's not gonna just pass turn. He's I, gonna say, okay, well, I now I have to justify that five plus cage dive in a way that sure. I would never do on turn three. Yeah, 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 yeah. Quote unquote, unquote over. Of course, yeah. yeah. But those yeah. are the those are the chances that you have to go for. And I just don't think it's I I, I think it's uh, it's the thing that annoys Elliot as well. Uh, but it's it's this it's this calling of the game early in a in a way that you don't actually really mean either. Because that, yeah, like, that, that's reasonable. Thing. Well, yes, we're, it's not literal. Like, it's not literal, but you know, people say loads just, of things that aren't literal. Oh, just yeah. finished my dinner. Oh, was it nice? Oh, uh, it was absolutely lovely. A lovely pork fillet with roast potatoes, parsnips, and some beans. Ooh, mm. parsnips! Oh, oh, slightly parsnips. dill, slightly anchovy sauce, a little piquant sauce. Was oh, lovely! So I uh, just got back. This is over then. <laughs> <laughs> PC. Yep. <laughs> oh, brilliant. And that's when the commentary team stopped talking. <laughs> it's all just perfect. I got, I got nothing else. I got nothing to say to that. I've just, you know, I've been, I've been told. So that's, me. that's me done. No, I don't disagree with anything you just said, Callan. I just like I do think I think you're right. The biggest point there is like when Jim when Jim says this is over, he's not like you might as well just concede the game is done. Yeah. But that doesn't convey to the average listener. Correct. But also, no, fuck him. Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah I get this is over. I obviously mean you are in a position where you are likely to lose this game. Therefore, you must try things that change that outcome. Yeah, exactly. as things exactly. and this exactly. looks like it is over. Mm -hmm. yeah. You are not going to be able to win from here. Therefore, don't be here. Oh, wow. But yeah, uh, obviously, I was timing that for comedic effect. Yeah, no, of course, and and well done. It was it was, it was pretty perfect. I'm, I think I think the ball could just get whizzed here and end the game. For uh, realsy, for realsy, realsies now. If you wanted to, nah, then it would be over. Away, yeah. He's too far away. I think oh, is just... he, is he, yeah, Amazons are so slow. <laughs> Amazons have a lot of powers, but speed is not usually one yeah, of them. Yeah, yeah, that's fair. They're really slow. Mm. Oh, no. My odds are dropping down to ninety-one percent. Terrible. Uh, it's over. <laughs> it's over, <laughs> over, man. Oh, wait, wait! Don't tell me it's over because I've got eleven points now, and my odds are up to. No, oh, wait! They went down five percent. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at thirty yeah. percent. Is he just three three doing this shit at? Mm. Instead of going for the strength four. No, he no, is going for the strength four. Yeah. Tackle mighty fuwa. Yeah. Face everybody up because you've got four more players than your opponent. Yeah. <laughs> 
and like that's they've got inevitability, haven't they? That's that's another thing as well from uh, from Magic the Gathering is inevitability, yeah. the concept of inevitability, and uh, the Zons have certainly got that. So they need to not, they just need to like not let make the, mistakes. The yeah. Dark Elves get back into it somehow. Yeah. The, yeah. the Boomer, what holidays do you celebrate that involve Dill? <laughs> <laughs> Am I missing something? <laughs> Oh, mid midsummer potatoes and dill and water. That's a new one to me. Mm. And a crayfish, so you must be from the south, I guess? Southern I, I was just if he's celebrating midsummer, doesn't that make him a pagan? Mm. <laughs> Isn't that, um... Oh, I love dill chips. Or oh, wicker. Yeah, wicker, yeah. Oh, the bees! The bees! <laughs> the bees! <laughs> The Houston quarterback is got minus one Crayfish, and... <laughs> crayfish well, doesn't strike me as a as a Scandinavian <laughs> thing. I, uh, maybe don't they call it like Langustine up there? The, that's uh, that would be France. Ah, uh, okay. I thought that was Northern Europe. Um, it's mostly called a Langustine in the UK, but a lot of that's about marketing. I was. Yeah, fair enough. It's called a fucking lobster. That's what it is. Yeah. Come on. You gotta say the fucking before it, too. <laughs> lobster. Lobster. La lobster. Lobster. There you go. Uh, uh, too much R on the end of it. Yeah. More of an A-H. Lobster. Lobster. That's better. Lobster. Of course, the, um... Boston Lobster. lobster. Minotaur. Lobster. Minotaur. <laughs> All of the, um... It was the uh, the the Nordic countries that first introduced uh, barcoding on all of their uh, fishing vessels as well, yeah? Mm-hmm. And um, then it went over to their. Um, I thought that was the Welsh. No, it was their military ones as well, because they had the Scandinavian. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was the Welsh. See what I did? Barcodes. <laughs> oh, barcodes. <laughs> nice. That's better than my one. This is, this is how you actually know the game is over. It's bad puns. <laughs> You have to know your audience as well. Most of the lads watching their dads, right? <laughs> Nothing wrong with a couple of dad jokes. Yeah. Thank you, Absolute Pinnacle. I appreciate it. Yeah. Magical. <laughs> Steve calling out for... Oh no, it's Doug calling out for his long lost father. <laughs> so it did pretty well here to kind of restabilize, because um, he was under a lot of pressure. It's amazing what a couple of twos and threes will do for you if you're an elf. Yeah. Well, we've got an esteemed elf coach in the booth. <laughs> Not all about yeah. that. It's, it's all we've got, is our ability to you know occasionally do things on a two plus mm -hmm. uh, and in extremis maybe maybe have to roll a three to be fair i've watched some of your dwarf games you know few and far between and yeah, uh, very you know, occasional times I very I occasional guess. but you i have seen you roll a lot of uh, two pluses when you're going on them um for their <laughs> gfs well i mean with elves pleasant that you just move the wrist to the other point of the movement you you do the, the risk either mid move or early in the move to either get off what's marking you or get past things. Yes. So there's still a lot of two pluses involved. Yeah. And of course, for a dwarf, the uh, safest thing they can do if they're um, base to base with somebody is to roll the one dice block. And for an elf, the safest thing they can do is to roll the uh, one dice dodge. And uh, both are the same. Mm. Hmm. I know, right? Yeah. yeah so actually, I, I, I don't do a lot of dwarfing, but I hear that you try and actually avoid the one die if at all possible. Well, it's but... the thing that annoys uh, everybody isn't the fact that dwarves can one die, it's that they do it even though they don't need to. <laughs> like, yes, they're which actually good I, enough. I, to, you know, well, I'll just put a in and make it a 2D, but yeah. But yeah, yes, exactly. I am aware that has occasionally happened. <laughs> Stop fucking one dying me, you prick. <laughs> yeah. Yes, and then you do face one of those games where you spend a lot of time and effort making sure that you're not doing 1Ds and putting 2Ds everywhere, and they just do 1Ds back and it all works. Yeah, it all so. works perfectly, yeah. Well, yeah. Why, bother why bother getting out of bed? Yeah, Let's indeed. Let's just all die. 
What's the great thing about playing it on the PC on the on the laptop, isn't it? You don't have to even have to get out of bed. Um, yeah, to be fair, I you can say all that all as long as you want sandwich. It's uh, I'm I'm not gonna be <laughs> not gonna be following in your in your wake of calling him that. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm only so much sexual tension I can handle. I could stand for a bit more. <laughs> I'll send it to you on the postcard. Or not a postcard, <laughs> just in the mail, yeah. I mean, I, I have to say, Skuro, I think it, it oozes out of every um, everything you ever say on stream. There's a man mm -hmm. that needs more sexual tension in his life. <laughs> mm. <laughs> that's that's not a shock. for that these days, I hear. <laughs> <laughs> you got a package for him. <laughs> hey! Uh... Wait. Pretty tricky to try to get through this. Um, more Daniel Bedingfield quotes. Yes. So I, I wasn't here. Are they? Are they none of these elves coming back? Are they all gone forever? Forecast. Uh, forever. Yeah. Yep. 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 Okay. Yeah. Pretty rough. Oh yeah. Wow. In, including a um, there was a perm on one and MNG I think and uh, that guy, that girl's dead. That was uh, just a badly hurt, I think, thankfully. Yeah, badly hurt. Yeah. And she was... Uh, well, she badly already had hurt. the nickel. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's just badly hurt, yeah. yeah. Or the armor bust, and that guy's... Nickel. Nickel, yeah. So, yeah. So, a perm, two BHs, and a dead. So, going to be tricky for the next round, should he, uh, should he manage to prevail against these... Uh... He's got a chance, it's not over. It's not, like. Well, I mean, um, I, I find if you knock most teams down to about three or four players, it's definitely over. With elves, you need <laughs> yep, to it, kill that's them. Not, not, but, yeah, it's, I mean, even, you know, if you're, I mean, I'd much rather have three elves left than have, like, you know, a couple of skinks left or, yes. you know. If there's a if there's a race that, race that can uh, withstand being uh, down to a few numbers, it's, it's elves. But if you're down to a couple of skinks, that means they haven't been killing the skinks and you're going to win. <laughs> you know, that's a great point. Yeah, well made. I'd rather I suppose have most of the hope here is in the two, two blodge step pieces and uh, and the strength four. The, the fact the strength four doesn't have dodge starts to look a bit of a dereliction of duty, really, as the coach, doesn't it? Yeah, it's pretty tricky, especially with the guard. I suppose the problem with the guard as well, especially on the strength forward pieces, is just very difficult for you to... Have him in a position where he can go and score as well, right? Yeah, but PC, imagine, blow. imagine if he can level yeah. him up and get block and sidestep in this tournament. He'll be great, great player. <laughs> yeah, he'd be really good, wouldn't he? Yes. Or, sorry, dodge and sorry, dodge and sidestep. Dodge and sidestep. Yeah, that would be incredible. Well, oh, you can have them on the wow. bench now. Oh, <laughs> man, that's really rough. Yeah, this is all kinds of shit. But it's not over, Cal. It's not over. No, it's not. No, no. Don't say it's over. Well, is there still a witch on the pitch? No, those presumably no, all died. Yeah, one, yeah. One's permanently dead and one of them lost armor. Yeah. A lot now rests on where that plus agility Amazon goes. Yeah, I would have gone deeper. Uh, yeah. 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 Yep. Because if I can move anything up the field, then just punting the ball and trying to win the race to it appeals yeah. to me right now. Even just that loner can get the ball hooked at him. Yeah. I mean, the Blitz is a 3-2 away from getting up the field. That's not terrible as an elf. Mm -hmm. As an elf. As an elf coach. <laughs> yeah, and the sidestep is the same, 3-2, but... But off, uh, he's only moved six, and it's, and it's yeah, off. Yeah, he doesn't go as I quick. I mean, he hasn't got tackle, but yeah. I mean, he hasn't got... He, this one hasn't got dodge, so he... he one hasn't got dodge, so it's the same. Plus, so, yeah. so at least the two pluses are one in 36. So it's not terrible, but it's about range. It's the range. But if you can get those two up the field, then mm -hmm. feasibly just hoinking the ball up there and hoping the plus agility doesn't make it makes its one in nine. It's peak, isn't it? If you stand the loner up and blitz through it with the blitzer, and then the other elf that side can dodge up and you've got at least a little pack of three that you could try and hoik the ball over to. Yeah, that like might that, mouth, yeah. that might give you something. Yeah, stand yeah. up and blitz, yeah. Yeah. Stand him up. Yeah, stand blitz up. up there, yeah. Then bring that one up too. And then 
probably run across the bottom of the field and toss the ball up to the blitzer mm -hmm. and then see if I've got others I can bring to maybe I don't know God, it's all awful isn't it yeah it's pretty bad gent doesn't look like he's going for any of those by the look of ish could put to this one actually oh, oh I need one I know oh, we went for the three two. Oh, we did go for the three two. okay I was thinking come back this way right with him oh and I guess then, he uses uh, dodge on the second one, one. So. Because at first I thought about blitzing the lineman, but now I was thinking, what if what if this guy comes down here, and then blitz yeah. this, and then you've got a bit more you do, yeah. together, but obviously the more penetration is better as well. Always. Always. Not always, because sometimes you need more uh, you need more like protection or stabilization. Than yeah, penetration. that's fair. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I need a lot of stabilization when I'm trying to penetrate. Yeah. 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 That's the the initial concern is stabilization, and then, and then you need to probe. You need to probe left and right, and then <laughs> scaffolding while still while still keeping the protection. And then and then you know and then the penetration. You need to at yep. least penetrate at some point. You need some penetration, yeah, you otherwise, do, you do, yeah. otherwise you know it's not, not going to be a good time. Four zebras. Hello, yeah, zebras is very strong. <laughs> How are you, see, bro? Good to see you, buddy. Hmm. Just oh. hunting. Yeah. Intercept. She didn't catch it. <laughs> Intercept. She did. Oh, wow. <laughs> I mean, it was pretty obvious, right? It was. We, we knew it was over. That's why. Yeah. Is she, is she Not over it? yet. No, not she just bought the six. So, yep. It's also not not over, though, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, when you put it that way, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, tricky now, because you daren't hit the... Sidestepper. If you can just move. Yeah, you just you? run around yeah, and yeah, yeah, jump. Yeah. yeah. But it's the, the sequencing is, 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 is interesting. Mm. The sequencing of no dice rolling whatsoever to completely mm -hmm. protect the ball. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's Correct. Very important. <laughs> Don't say it's over. <laughs> like if he accidentally if he accidentally moves the ball first and then hits end turn by accident, sure. Yeah, yeah it's over. Yeah. yeah. Big mistake. <laughs> I do worry that sometimes Eliod just fires Blood Bowl 2 up all on his own when there's no one else around. Just looks mm -hmm. at all those old Chalice teams up to the Eliod name. But he'll never coach again. Just it, looks at each one and says, It's not over. <laughs> say it's this, over. Is, this is pretty minor, but just he has his cage a, up here. Here, drips down his cheek. Yeah. yeah. Then he turns exactly it off and goes back to bed. <laughs> Perhaps just in my like, imagination, but you never know. You can just not blitz like, this side step, but you can just cage up right and just not blitz this guy. You don't have to blitz Yeah, him. Yeah, but he doesn't have cage on the corners here. Yeah, but like, you can just like, move this guy instead of blitzing. That's what I'm saying. Instead of blitzing, yeah, you can yeah, just fill uh, in the cage. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. So he, he didn't have to blitz here. Mm -hmm. Like, oh, he was always going to because he's won, but he didn't have to. Like, yeah. it, I think it was better to not blitz at that point and just come down right. and complete the cage. My, my, no, but my point is, like, for not having to dice roll the cage at all, he should have guard on both corners, and he doesn't. Yep. yep. True, true, yep, true. That's what he should have done. He should have just moved them up and not blitzed this sidestep. He should have just literally, as you say, just guard on each corner. And Could have uh, spent a little bit more time at the start and, uh, you know, gone through the sequencing, because the sequencing was quite interesting. <laughs> hey! Banter. Only somebody had mentioned that. And, yeah, but uh, then also we mentioned that he just had to move everybody without rolling any dice, and he just chose right, not to. Right. What, I, what, I, what I was just yeah. saying is he did. He had no way to fuck up this turn, and he still kind of fucked it up, in the most minor way possible. For sure, yeah. yeah. But, but like, yeah, like, you know, I, I think if he'd taken some a little bit of extra time and worked it out, he would have been able to get a, a nicer cage and had the corners sorted as well oh, but it is what it is and uh we're left here Don't so it's just a, it's, the, it's the dive in um it's just a question of how he decides to go about it i don't suppose he can dive now <laughs> yeah. you bring the blitz the um 
the blood step right onto the front of it and then just go straight in. It needs sorting, and it needs sorting quickly. It's only going to get worse. Agreed. If it's going to get sorted, which it isn't, but if it is, it gets sorted now. Let's do uh, reverse the field. He has reversed the field. Yeah. Oh, yep. Oh, oh. Well, uh, he's got the reroll for it, because that wasn't his... Uh, he'd already popped dodge. Yep, he's got it. He's got the 1D. No, it feels a GFO. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah. I thought that was the right play. Yeah. 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 Yep. But unfortunately for him, it was already over. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Will you make a cage this turn? Or oh, keep it interesting? Some interesting sequencing. Very super uh, interesting. Yeah, super interesting. Yeah, correct. Jeez, <laughs> uh, the temptation's pretty high to pass it to her, isn't it? Yeah, uh, I'd definitely go for that. I, I would, but I, I like you can set up to do it next turn. I think I would have brought her down to the bottom instead for that reason. Yeah. Um, now just to protect the ball, that running dice. Yep, didn't bother, but it's okay. Now we're good. Yep. Apart from not having a guard on opposite cage corners. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's an okay, it's an okay, Lon. I don't think if he had taken more time last turn, he would have ended up with the correct. Yeah, but I, well, he, he also won't like he's, this is only take this is take all oh, of this is taking him less than thirty seconds. So I think he's just kind of wrapping up, and um, this yes. is the other side of the I've won and this game is over. Is you start making kind of you start being sloppy because things are going really well for you. Yeah. And uh, you kind of because you just kind of lose interest in what you're doing and just go, oh, I'll just do these things, and then you make mistakes as a result of it. Well, actually, the ball can't even be hit now, so no, nope. it is over. <laughs> no, 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 no! Look, we've got this blitzer. We've got this blitzer. Oh, he is. I thought he was one out. I thought he was one out. Yeah, we've got this blitzer, and the the lino can can cancel the assists if he wanted, and then get a one D. So three, three two two. Yeah. Three, so they can go three, in for the three three two 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 and then two four no two five two two six. <laughs> I mean it's yeah. pretty likely. We yeah, don't, don't say it's over. Yeah, yeah. It's not over. <laughs> don't say it's you know, over. Just fucking roll the dice, like. And then with the fact the fact that you've got the problem is that this guy is up here, so that makes you really can't do the handoff until turn sixteen, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. That's the problem. Like if this guy mm -hmm. was down, then you could just totally you could just totally hand off to this guy, and then you've got the bolt in case it goes wrong. Okay, Lona. So if this fails, then you blitz the side step and okay, yeah. Oh. So you blitz the side stepper, and and you probably. Uh, then you can probably try three handoffs to this uh, strength five. Yeah. Also, handing off to this one's pretty good, right? Rick would get guard. Yeah. Also, the what's the what's the ball carrier on? Because she got the interception as well, so that would have added thirty nine. So no, that's fine. So yeah, maybe getting the blitzer guard or yeah, because that girl's not getting blocked. There's nothing there, or just to get some points on her, make her MVP ready. Um, it would be just four off. Yeah, well, he's already and moved the splitter back. I quite like, I quite like handing off to this, especially as it's Rick. That makes it even funnier, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Imagine losing a chalice game because you're trying to skip, frivolously skill up a player called Rick Reckless would be the best. It was obviously the right play. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hope you had a lovely holiday, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you should definitely be trying to frivolously skill him up, especially as that's staying down. Like, at least yeah, this one. At least get the points on, on C Bros. Yeah. Well, see, please, actually, you, you don't need hey, to skill Don't say it's over, though. It's horribly wrong and you never pick it back up again. It, it doesn't matter. Exactly, yeah, yeah. Like, it's you hard. absolutely yeah. have to go for it now. Yeah. Oh. Maybe you could have made it safer than this, but. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. But I mean, he's probably not going to try and pick it up and punt. Like, it would just be vindictive to pick it up and punt, wouldn't it? 
exactly why I'd do it, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, me too. Folks, yeah. folks, it has been 16 turns, and it all came down to this final <laughs> turn. The game <laughs> is just about over here. Nothing to stop Martin Septum from going up 2-0 in a hard-fought, very close game from start to finish. <laughs> No one likes a, a, a sore winner, lads. <laughs> no, doesn't get it. Screwed by uh, the... Oh! Oh, yeah. oh. oh well. everyone needs to set up a chain for, to, uh, to yeah. scatter into the end zone and the, the bubble box into the end zone is what he should have done. But again, you can't fault him for not being... Uh, oh, and, the, and this... this yeah. Oh, no, this wasn't the one. I thought this Maybe was the one that needed this. So it wasn't. No. Um, so there you go. But MVP away. Um, yeah. Congratulations, Martin Septum. Great win and commiserations to Tempestol, who basically the stadium was diced and Martin Septum was uh, sorry, Martin Septum diced Tempestol out of it almost immediately, right? With the uh, with the yep. instant cars and then the foul on the edge five and everything. So yeah, Fireball pretty, not doing what he wanted. Yeah, pretty brutal match. Uh, pretty brutally one-sided match there. Over by the first half, but what can you do? Um, thank you very much, Kalon, Escuro, and PC. Absolutely glorious having you guys here. Pleasure. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.